Hello friends. This video is brought to you by MyWayTeaching.com. Making a graph makes the study of the data even easier. And bar graph is the simplest of them. A bar graph is a representation of numbers using bars and these bars are of equal width but the length of the bars depend upon the frequency and the scale that we choose. For example in this graph width of each bar is equal but the length is variant which is dependent on the frequency that will be based on the data given and the scale that we have chosen is dependent on the data and the fact that each unit is representing one observation. While for some other bar graph, one unit may represent 10 observations. That means that depending on the data, the scale has to be chosen and the scale also alters the length of the bar. In other words, we can say the, that length of the bars in the bar graph are dependent on the frequency and the scale that we choose. Let us read the question. 200 students of 6th and 7th classes were asked to name their favorite colors so as to decide what should be the color of their school building. The results are shown in the following table represent the given data on a bar graph and answer the following questions. To draw the bar graph, we will start the scale at 0. Now let us try to choose a suitable scale. The greatest value in the data is 55. So we will have to end the scale somewhere such that the value is greater than 55. Maybe we would like to end it at 60. Let us make equal divisions on our vertical axis and start with an increment of 10. Hence we have chosen the scale 1 unit is equal to 10 students and we have mentioned that we are depicting number of students on the vertical axis. Also note that we have to choose a scale such that the bars that would come should not be too long nor too small. Also on the horizontal axis mark equal distances and depict the other variant factor that is the favorite colors. Now we will draw bars of equal width according to their likings. Now since 43 students like red color corresponding to red color on the horizontal axis, we draw a bar of length 43 units. Similarly, 
since green color is liked by 19 students, a bar is drawn whose length is 19 units. Similarly, a bar corresponding to blue color depicting that 55 students like it is drawn and notice that width of each bar is same but length is varying due to change in frequency. Similarly, corresponding to yellow color and orange color we make bars depicting 49 students like yellow color and 34 students like orange color. Now let us read our question further. Answer the following question with the help of the bar graph. Which is the most preferred color and which is the least preferred color? And secondly, how many colors are there in all? What are they? Now looking at the graph, we can see that the longest bar is of blue color. That means blue is the most preferred color. The shortest bar is of green color. So green is the least preferred color. And there are five colors in all, namely red, green, blue, yellow and orange.